so yeah uh, this is the remove nodes from a linked list so what the problem statement is you need to remove every node such that which has a node strictly greater than value anywhere to the right side of it so you need to delete this nodes because see uh, 13 is greater than 5 uh, so you need to remove 5 now 13 is greater than 2 so you need to remove 2 now 3 is uh, less than 8 so you need to remove 3 so what you need to do if any uh, for any node if uh, to the right side if uh, any node has a greater than value than your current node then you need to delete that and you need to modify that now what what the main institution is i'll i'll just quickly draw this linked list which is 5 2 13 and 3 8 right and 3 8 now what we will be doing uh, we will take an array we will take an array so that uh, uh, we will insert the data now initially if our array is empty we will direct the insert the node value into our array so now we will insert 5 now we will insert 5 now your iterator moves on this because uh, this is your temporary node uh, you can uh, you can take it as a, some temporary node and you can just iterate <coughs> now you see uh, now you uh, coming back to 2 now you'll check now you'll check the last value with your current value that means if you are checking the two uh, whether the two is greater than five or it is less than five if it is less than five you just insert that value into your array you just insert the value into your array now your iterator will will come over here and now you'll again check now you'll again check whether it is lesser than that or it is greater than that if it is a greater value then your last element can i say you need to pop from that because it is the rightmost greater value which has appeared after some values so according to the problem statement we need to remove all these before nodes so what we will do we will compare uh, whether the two uh, whether our 13 is uh, less than uh, since it is greater than two uh, we will pop this last element now you again come and check for 5. Now it's again 5 is less than 13. So you will again pop this element. So you will again pop this element. Now after this what you will do. You just once you if your array becomes empty. You just insert that value. You just insert that value. Now your iterator will move over here. And now you again ins you will again check. Whether 13 is uh, sorry 3 is less than 13 whether 3 is less than 13 if it is satisfies the condition you just insert that you just push that data into your array now you will again come to 8 and you again check whether your 8 is less than 3 or not if the condition is not satisfying you will just pop you will just pop that element and you again check with 13 8 is less than or equal less than 13 or not since it is satisfying the condition you just make your array uh, you just make your array like that and you just insert your 8 so now what are the elements that you are getting it is only 13 and 8 so what you will do you just simply construct a linked list uh, from starting to end with this values with this values so this is the main institution you just insert that element so whenever you're inserting that element just compare the last element just compare the last element of the array if it is lesser than the last element you can insert that you can insert that otherwise you need to pop until it is greater until it is a greater element so that is the main condition that you need to make so this is the simple algorithm uh, I can quickly show you my code yeah initially you will take a temporary pointer which is pointing to head and you take a array and you take a uh, some array now uh, while your temp is not equal to null you just iterate you just iterate on your linked list head see 
If your array contains zero elements, you can directly push back that value because that is the starting element or or all the elements that got popped. If it is not the condition, can I say we will be we will be popping back until until our current value is greater than the last value. Uh, this condition. While you are inserting thirteen, thirteen uh, is greater than two. Thirteen is greater than five. You need to pop that elements which are smaller than that, which are smaller than that, right? So ultimately, what you need to make this is like a decreasing, decreasing order, right? So we will be popping that elements, and once once if you popped all the elements, you just insert that, you just insert that element. Now you just simply move your iterator to the next node, and you again repeat the process. Once after you completed this process, your array will be thirteen and eight, right? Your array will be thirteen and eight. Now you just you just simply uh, create a node with the starting value, and you make an another temporary pointer which is pointing to your answer that is root. So from the iterator, uh, so you need to you need to iterate from one till a dot size, right? because why i was making like this because you already created a node with the zeroth value which is starting value so that's what i was starting with i equal to 1 so you just uh, you just you just create a node uh, from the next and you just and you just simply move that move that move to forward right So this is what the main intuition behind this. So I think it's a simple algorithm. Like, uh, while you're iterating to next, you should create a next node. You should create a next node with that value, and you should move to that node, and you should move to that node. So, uh, if you if you can submit this, I can see it got accepted. So this is the main intuition behind this. If you understand this, yes, please, please, please do like and comment. and subscribe